Um, welcome to this week's vlog. Um, clearly in Westminster, uh, the big news of the week was Rishi Sunak, the Chancellor's announcement on Wednesday, which was tens of millions of pounds worth of intervention to get our economy re-going. There will be bits of it that you would have been immediately pleased by, that you can get up to a tenner back per person uh, on the bill for when you go out for food, all part of an effort to get us going back out and giving our business to pubs, restaurants, cafes uh, in our community. Um, there was money to get us doing home improvements, particularly those that make our homes more energy efficient. There was money to get businesses to invest in apprenticeships and traineeships, all of which will be great for helping to people to retrain at a time when unemployment may well rise. And then there was a whole raft of other support that will be hugely important to thousands of local businesses as they try to navigate the stormy waters of the next few months. And it was great to see the Chancellor be so bold in his intervention. Down here in Somerset, uh, the big news, uh, really, I think for a lot of people in our local area has been the two pubs that have closed in Burnham-on-Sea um, as a consequence of customers who had tested positive for COVID. Now, there's a really important point to make about that, which is that there's no suggestion whatsoever that those people caught COVID in the pub. All it is, is that people who had got COVID from somewhere had been to a pub. And as a consequence, when they were tested and then subsequently all of the people they'd come into contact with traced, everybody who was in the pub at the same time as them has since been called and both pubs have closed in order to have a deep clean. Now, I can understand how that is a cause for concern and it's right that we are cautious about when we go out and that we make sure that we're washing our hands and keeping our distance and doing all of that stuff. But it's also really important to remember that you can go out and be safe. The businesses are doing everything they need to do to mitigate and to make sure that there are screens and that servers are wearing PPE and that tables and are appropriate distance apart. And if we go out and make sure that we wash our hands and we keep our distance and we behave responsibly, we can support local businesses, we can get our economy going and we can be safe. And I hope that people will continue to do that rather than being unnecessarily concerned about actually the system working well in Burnham. Some people tested positive, they, the people they came into contact with traced, everybody as a result has been made safer. And that's actually a good thing, not a bad, I think. More next week.